everybody, it's Becky. I wanted to film a party haul for you guys. I am throwing my girls a an unbirthday luau next week. And if you watched my summer goals video, I talked about how I wanted to have them an unbirthday party because both of them have winter birthdays and we never get to do anything fun outside. So that on my list of summer goals is going to be checked off very soon. Um, but I wanted to share with you everything I got and everything came from either the Dollar Tree or Oriental Trading Company. You guys know how much I love them and so I wanted to share everything I got. And I'll tell you where everything came from. For the girls that come to the party, they're each going to get a hula skirt and a lace. So these hula skirts came from Oriental Trading in a pack of 12. And this is the child set. Since my oldest daughter is 12 I, and I knew it had an adjustable waistband, I took a chance that it would fit my six-year-old and her friends and my 12-year-old and her friends and it does fit them both. It's a little tight for my 12-year-old but um, you can you can extend it out and it's got velcro and it's a really nice hula skirt and it comes with an assortment of colors we have 12 of those and then we probably won't need that many um, and then i also have these lays which came from the dollar tree and there's a pack there's three in a pack so i've got three packs of those because i don't know yet um, how many girls are coming oh i lied too we do have one thing from someplace else the flamingo pinata came from hobby lobby it was really reasonable. I think it was like $12. I used a 40% off coupon, so that was exciting. From the Dollar Tree, Aloha sign. It's on a stick, but you can take it off and hang just that part, but we're gonna stick it out in the yard so people know that's where the party is. From Oriental Trading, I have the beanbag toss game, which obviously I have not opened, but you'll see it, because I'm gonna do a video um, right before the party to show you how I used everything and how everything looked and was decorated, so um, you'll see that open next week. For the craft, I got this. Now the only thing was, the one I wanted had like flip-flops and it said Aloha and had a hibiscus flower, but they were out of stock. So I went ahead and got these. And this is what the girls are gonna make as their craft. And I think it's still really cute. And so it comes in a bag like this. And one thing I love about Oriental Trading, and I've talked about it before, they send a bag of extra pieces. So they send extra beads or whatever. So there's, I think, 12 of those. So each girl will get to make one. And it's a really nice bracelet. The only thing I changed was I added my own lobster claw clasp. Um, because I'm not very good at tying like the stretchy stretchy cording for bracelets and stuff so I just use a crimp bead and a um, lobster claw clasp that I got at Hobby Lobby I already had it actually and so we're going to make those at the party as something to give away to the girls they I also got from Oriental Trading this cute little bag of uh, hula bears and it comes in a bag like this so you have a whole assortment of colors there's a purple one a yellow one a blue one and they have a little flower and a little hula skirt uh, there's yellow you already saw that one there's orange and white and a different color purple looks like yeah so I thought they were so super cute and I just thought the girls would love those and they do come on a string if they want to hang them from a doorknob or some kind of a tree even for a Christmas ornament I thought they were really cute and the last thing I got from Oriental Trading is the lighted hibiscus flower garland now, I'm not going to open it just yet um, just because I, I don't want to have a chance of breaking it before the party, but I think it's nine feet long It's got white lights on it, and we're going to use that obviously for decor I'm going to use that and I'll show you'll see that when I do the after video um, Everything else came from the Dollar Tree. So I found these little party umbrella like these little umbrella straws that were really cute We got the plates and the napkins at Dollar Tree and you can see they have like parrots on the on the plates and then the napkins match and then we also have the cups that have flamingos and toucan and hibiscus flowers the my daughters are going to drink out of these coconut cups they have a little straw hole right there um so my youngest opened hers but they're going to have those since they're the, the party girls and everybody else will have one of these um we found this lantern and it's got the same design as the plates and it uses AAA batteries and it has like a hook so we can hang it out outside or from our light in the kitchen, I haven't decided yet. I got two of these table fringe things. I don't know if I'll use one per table or if I'll need two to go around one table. I haven't opened it so I don't really know if it's gonna be big enough or not, but I got two of those. I got one tablecloth. Again, not really sure which table I'm gonna use it on because we're gonna be doing some things inside and some things outside, so I'm not really sure about that, but I did get these tablecloth weights in case we do use it outside and that way I don't have to worry about it blowing away. I thought those were really neat. They were with the barbecue stuff. Then to um, to hide, like to cover up the windows, like we have 
that door and the door that leads to the office. I got these other uh, wall decorations, but I'm going to actually hang them on the door so that they look like you're kind of in a tropical paradise. I got the flamingos and the birds. And then to match, we also have the inflatable toucan, the inflatable parrot, and the inflatable palm tree. And then they wanted these swirl decorations that hang. Again, they have the bird and the hibiscus. And then these little cutouts, which we're just gonna kind of stick on the wall. So that is everything. I'm really excited. The girls are getting, the girls have been so excited ever since we talked about it. And I'm just happy that I'm actually doing something that I planned on doing as busy as I've been this summer with reorganizing our homeschool room and office and doing all that stuff and prepping for next homeschool year. I'm really glad that I prioritized the time that it has taken so far just to plan the party and then what's how much time it's going to take to clean, decorate, and have the party. But I know the girls are going to love it. Their friends are going to love it. The invitations are really cute. I needed to show you... I don't have an invitation to show you actually. I think they took them all to give out to their friends. But I made them just using pictures I found online and PicMonkey and they turned out so cute. So if I can find an, um, an extra one on my computer, I'll insert it at the end of this video just so you can see the invitation. And I think it turned out really cute and you don't have to buy things on Etsy or if you don't want to. If you have a little bit of time, you can really make really cute invitations on your own and plus I enjoy stuff like that so I just sent them to Kinko's and had them print them on nicer paper but other than that I made them at home and I thought they, I think they turned out really cute so I'm excited for you guys to see the party um, it's not till next weekend so it'll be um, at least a, it'll be about a week and a half or two weeks before you actually see the after video but I wanted to share with you everything I got in case you were planning a luau and you wanted to get some ideas the Dollar Tree does still have some of their um, luau stuff out and then the stuff that I got from Oriental Trading. Uh, as far as I know, they have this stuff all year long, not just in the summer. So hope you guys like this video and I will see you in the next one. Bye.